you have probably some of the biggest comebacks I've ever seen. And that's coming from a guy who's known for hitting comebacks. What's up, everybody? Welcome to another fun episode of Race Reviews. And today, we're not doing mine, but we have a special guest, Joseph Fambule. How you doing? It's going to be reviewing his favorite races, handpicked by him. Yeah. And uh, Joseph, yeah, known as a 200 guy, but also an amazing 100 meter runner as well. Thank you for saying that. Thank you. You're very welcome. You have probably some of the biggest comebacks I've ever seen. And that's coming from a guy who's known for hitting comebacks. Yeah. <laughs> so I'm intrigued <laughs> to watch yeah. these videos myself. <laughs> Let's get to it. All right, let's get in here. So which video have you played, or are you gonna play for us first here? This is the uh, Pepsi Relays 2022, my last season in, in college. Okay. Coming off of a injury indoors where- I remember uh, that year. Yeah, Evan, yeah. So it was my, I think, was this my first race outdoors? I think so, because I ran SECs indoors, mm -hmm. but I, it wasn't really good. But anyways, yeah, and as, we have Randolph, we have Lance, um, we have Matt, we have Dwight, and then um, who's on the outside? I, I can't see tell. that far out. And it's super blurry, but yeah. yeah. All right, well, it's on you, Spacebar to go and Spacebar to pause. Cool. So I'm assuming that you were already like ex excited, nervous? I was, I was excited, excited because this, it was my last race as being it was my last photo relays as being a gator. Yeah. And I was excited because this was like a mini nationals. Because yeah. yeah. Oh yeah. I'm all the right. hitters. All the hitters. You know? Yeah, every all people have been showing the Florida relays more than they have uh Texas in my opinion in the last two years. And that's good. That's a good thing. Oh, I am here for it. <laughs> I don't know what I don't know what it is, but my start was just not the greatest. But it's it's okay. You know, what I'm <laughs> so right here, people say that. Do you get panicked or 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 do you like stress? No, it's no. Just part of the process. <laughs> I've been here too many too many times. <laughs> okay, so it's good to know that I'm not the only one who yeah, thinks that no, way. It's As everybody passes you and be like, hmm. It's a nice race going yeah. on. Right there. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, not stressing whatsoever. Yeah. Joseph Bondelay, but on the inside is Lance Lang. And I knew if Matthew was ahead of me. Yeah. I love Matthew, right? But I wasn't gonna lose to Matt. You know what I'm saying? Like I was, oh, yeah. I was not gonna lose to Matt. And it was about my, my, my last one here. So I had to go again. So you know it where did you start making up your speed? Was it coming off the turn or was it as soon as you came onto the straight? Um, it's always coming off the turn. So, so like right here, are you building? About, up? yeah, no, yeah, yeah, yeah. So you build, 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 and then you, and then you stand up. And then by here, you've already built that momentum off of the curve and just yeah. stand up and you hold form. And you just run it now. Yeah. <laughs> That's wild. Every time that I see it too, it's just like, yeah, I did that. That's wild. <laughs> yeah, they they always say, how many like, what's your what's your stride length? Do you ever get tired? This and that. I'm like, dog. When I'm in the race, I just run. Yeah, I just run. Now, something that I always like, even like when you first came on the scene, is seeing how much power you put into the track. Mm -hmm. Like, especially in the last probably. 50 meters, mm -hmm. how much power you're still constantly just putting into the track right below you. Mm -hmm. Because a lot of people can have power, mm -hmm. but if you're not using it in the right direction, then mm -hmm. it's useless. Exactly. Like yours is like going right underneath you and just thrusting your knees right back into the air. Mm -hmm. And it's just like, yeah, yeah, he, he, you could just see that you got speed where everybody else looks like they're dying. It's like you still are giving what you need yeah. to in the rest of the race. And that also goes through. The training as well. Yeah. Know? Yeah. But yeah. I got my I got the lactic um threshold like that when I was biking. Like I would I would, I would oh, bike so you up. grew it like Oh yeah. No, yeah, from I was, I was in like high school. Yeah. I would bike up this hill, it's like bro, it was steep hill, 
gears on max and I was just just go, just go. Giving it. My legs were I couldn't move for like ten months after, afterwards. And that was every single day for the whole summer. And then after that and everything else just became Easy. What it is. No, yeah, like what it is. No, yeah. Uh, that's hilarious. Funny race though. No. Good race. No, great race. Would you would you end up running in there? Twenty point seventeen? Twenty yeah, twenty point two. I wouldn't yeah. Yeah, still a solid race, but yeah. that comeback, I mean, that got to give you a lot of confidence going into the yeah, it was my next first, few races. Yeah, first outdoor uh, meet of the year. Yeah. All right. I believe this is NCAAs because it's at Oregon. Yeah. Last <laughs> NCAA uh, 2022. My start again, they were saying, oh, Joe can't start well, Joe can't start well. I just ran 10 3 at regionals. Mm -hmm. It doesn't really matter to me. Everybody, everyone here in this lineup, Matthew, Sean, Dedrick, Favor, Micah, um, Jojo Martin, um, Jamonte Harding, and I can't see the last guy in, in lane nine. I can't see him, but they're all known for their starts. So a coach was like, if you're, if you're somewhat even, dog, a little close. Uh, if you if you can touch them, you're straight. Don't worry about that. It's if you can touch them, you're straight. And and I was like, okay, cool. That's what my coach tells me too. <laughs> I'm like, okay, great. just all you gotta do is be in striking distance. That's all you gotta do for people like us or like they have yeah. our uh, skill set. It, our fin the finishers. The finishers. Touch them. And it's over. You yeah. gonna get got. Exactly. Are you a person to rise slow in the blocks? I'd say yes, only because I need to feel the pressure mm. that I'm applying to the back block. But that hasn't always been that way. It's okay. only been the last two years. Okay. Usually it's like whenever. Like I, I would say I'm slow. I'm, not, I'm definitely not the last person, but I'm definitely not the first person. Okay. 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 Once again, I'm literally last. It dead last, yeah. L literally last. Yeah. Yeah. They got about a good four meters on you. Yeah. But as we said, it doesn't matter. It don't matter. Yeah, yeah. Hang on. Now I get into the 80. So Not did you yet. know that you won when you crossed that line? What's funny is when you're racing and there's people beside you you can see them on you can one Perfect. feel them and then see them right yeah. exactly so i got to a point where i got out i was like all right cool they're ahead of me mm -hmm. i can like see them and then i got here and i was like i can feel them mm -hmm. i didn't see dedrick or favor until i got about like right here in my mind i took two steps i was with them I took two steps. I was ahead of Ashley, yeah. but in reality, I took like I don't know, like eight steps. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And but it feels like that. Yeah. I took two more steps, and I was your head. I was ahead, and I thought that the last person that I saw before taking those steps was Sean. And so I was like, "All right, cool, me, Sean, Dedrick." <laughs> but then that wasn't the case. Yeah, yeah. You know, yeah, no, yeah, yeah. But uh, but yeah, it's wild. No, I guess it's it, not a bad time to boot there. I know. That's it. 10 on 1? Yeah. 10 flat, yeah. Yeah, it, Ryan, I was about to say, it's 10 flat. It's, it rhymes to 10 flat. And everyone was 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 still saying, Joe can't do it. Joe, Joe can't do it. And I was like, I'm going to just do it. Yeah, hit him with the call. Hit him with the call. With the hit him with the call. Ah! <laughs> uh, yeah. Yes, sir. Yeah. No, I ain't going to lie. Out of there. Out of there. I didn't have you win that either. <laughs> <laughs> I have you win the 100, but I definitely had you win in the 200. But I never bet on anybody. I'll tell you somebody, Josephus had been betting on you to win Swear. the 60, <laughs> the 100, the 200 for dog. two years in a row. Oh, my. Josephus, thank you, dog. Two thank years you. in a row. He always bet on you. And I'm like, Josephus, I see the 200. <laughs> I truly see it. What are you seeing in the hundred? I just gotta know. I need to know. I need to see it. Yeah. And when we and we saw the prelims, I'm like, okay, it could happen. Mm. I'm not, I was like, I'm putting you on the podium. Not putting you first. Mm. Just see, it's like, no, nah, 
He's my guy. He's my guy. I'm putting him on it. He's gonna win. Yeah. And the race went on. I'm like, dang, he did Ice, it. Yeah, yeah. Everyone was saying that, but it, it's okay though. It's, hey, it's all right. All you gotta do is believe in yourself. That's all you I, need. Literally. Yeah, applying force where it's needed. Mm-hmm. Right underneath the ground. You see how high your knees are already. I mean, look at yours and look at theirs. Yeah. Like, this is one of this right here is where I can usually tell everybody's ability. Yeah. Like usually, I mean, I don't know what happened to Makai. It looked like kind of gave up. Just, I mean, um, Matthew. He usually kind of gets to that position where he really presses. Favor. Just look. I mean, he's touching his butt. You're not, you can't. You can uh, cycle you can't, through. You, you, you're yeah. just cycling. You yeah. can't go anywhere with that. And then everybody else is kind of already out of the race. And yours is just, your shin angle is coming straight through. It's not, your, your heel isn't touching your butt. The knees are projecting right up into the air because of all that power, which means you're just able to throw it back down. I if you look at the next step, it's the exact same. Mm. And everybody else is leaning and you're just, yeah, you running forward with all that power. And you, you don't want to lean because you because you haven't crossed. You always when they say when when your coaches say run through the line, mm -hmm. you're building a habit. When you finish the race, you're not you're not pressing and it's just easier to just run through. Just yeah. run through. You want to run through the line, yeah. not run to the line. Exactly. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah, that's real nice. And they're all known to start well. Funny, funny, bro. Dedrick won SECs for the sixty. Mm -hmm. I remember um, that this uh, this same year. Yeah. In practice, literally before this race, I whooped his ass to sixty. <laughs> I bro, it was like thirty. No, thirty, because it was because 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 it was it was it was in the back. I whooped his ass to thirty. Coach said, "We're done here." <laughs> he we're said, done. "No more. You're good. You're good. We're done." He's like, "This is helping you, not helping you. Yeah. We gotta go." <laughs> well, then I hear Dedrick whooped my ass to like seventy, and I was like, "Ah, fuck." Hey, I get A B A. Don't when we're in our prime. Yeah. Don't sleep on the the, the finishers. <laughs> Very true. Very true. All right, let's move on to the yeah. next race. Um, our final race of the day. Now, I asked if you wanted to show your NCAA race, and you said that you wanted to show East Regionals mm -hmm. of 2022 more. Mm -hmm. Why did you want to show it more? When you're having fun, it's easy to run. When you're, when you're over here trying to stress and the, the pressure is, is on, you know, track isn't fun. And when you're having fun, you're just having a, uh, you're just more relaxed. East Regions was a good race from a technical standpoint, mm -hmm. as well as a uh, as a um, good time. And overall, I just felt better at East Regions than I did at Nationals. All right, let's see this uh, this more fun race <laughs> and better technical. No, yeah. Oh, look, you could touch him. I could touch him on the curve. Yeah. And I was like, hmm, if I could touch him on the curve, then coming around. I'm about to wild out. And now, yeah, I'm wilding out. Yeah, and then I mean, right here, I was smiling heavy. Yeah, I Cause, bet. Because <laughs> you know you did it. Because you knew you did it. Because I passed Matt and I was like, yeah, I'm, I'm like that. Everything is just flowing. Yeah. Thing is, coach. Oh my God, coach was in my ear talking crazy, talking like I can't say it on camera, obviously, but just on that hit that he was in in my ear, like how Aaron was to his dad, um, Aaron Yeager to his dad. Oh, talking, <laughs> talking that, talking crazy. That's how coach was, and I was like, Whoa. was this before or after? This was before. This was before <laughs> hours before, and up and into that car room, he was standing there looking at me dead in my eyes, and was like, "What are you gonna do?" I was like, is this in a good way or a bad or like an aggressive way? I'm trying to get the like you're telling me Aaron Yeager, so I'm over here like you better do it. Like you better get in there. Like if you ain't if you ain't up in the butt, 
it ain't any getting done. You know, it was like if pause, but <laughs> same, same, same line. No, yeah, no, <laughs> it was, it was very, it was very direct. That's all, <laughs> that's, that's all that I'm gonna say. No, no, but yeah, it was, yeah, it was a, a good race though. 1985. The wind, the wind was crazy. The wind was winding. But for sure. I didn't. Uh, I did it one more time at Nationals. Literally the next week. But it was a good race. Came off. I came off the curve nice. Um, arms was pumping. Knees was flying high. I was flowing. He was smiling. <laughs> I was smiling. Good race. Yeah. Overall, a good race. A good fun time. Yeah. So that was my third race of the day. Would uh, you would you say that's your favorite of the year? Yeah, I mean the, you chose this out of a lot of them, so I'm assuming this is one of your favorite races. Oh yeah, most deaf. Yeah. Yeah. Was yeah the races that the races that I, that I won are none none of them are my favorites because really just, mm -mm. I just don't I don't I, I don't know I feel like it was expected of us to do that so. It's the ones where you get to see the surprises. Right. Like, SEC 4x1, I was also smiling um, because I was with my boys, yeah. and then we won. And then this one, I was smiling. And um, the one, we, the first video we, we, we just watched, it was because I just came back from an injury, mm. and it was very special to me. Um, I guess the 200, because I did the... I won them both. The double. And back to back years. That that was cool. Yeah. yeah but it was a little cool. It was no, a little, a little cool. It was a little cool. Yeah. <laughs> not, <chain> <laughs> it's but, like flex, slight flex. But yeah, this these are the races that are that I that are permanently ingrained in my mind. I like that. I like that a lot. I would have never known that either. Mm -hmm. And I don't think any of them would have known that. So mm -hmm. Joseph, thanks for coming on here. Thanks for showing us your races and giving us an insight to these amazing moments. I mean I like to think of myself as the comeback kid, but I think you're the comeback kid. <laughs> <laughs> but we got to stick together, man. Of course, our of top, course. our top in killers right here. Look. All right, everybody. Um, if you enjoyed Joseph, please go follow him on social media. We'll make sure to put that down in the link below so you guys can all join him as he goes on his amazing journey. And if you haven't gone and seen the sprint talks with him, please go over there where we get a nice little insight into how his journey has gone as he's gone into being a professional runner for A6. Guys, thank you. Make sure you are liking, sharing, because we are trying to get to 100,000 before the end of the year. And if you haven't looked at the community page to see what that special moment is gonna be like, then please, Go over there and take a look. Take a gander. Check it out. Exactly. Yep. Until next time, guys, we'll see you then. Adios.